All right. Uh, as you can see right here, mm -hmm. just coming in frame Shoulder. right here, yeah. <laughs> Colonel John Farnham joins us from MCAS Miramar. And Colonel, thanks for joining us. Some people might think it's a little early because we're talking about this year's air show, right. which isn't until early October, but you say we got to start early. Yeah. That's it. October 2nd through the 4th. It seems like forever away, but it's not. Uh, the planning cycle for the air show is 14 months long. So. On our end, boy, we're in the thick of it, and uh, tickets are on sale, and we're happy to be here to talk about it for a minute. Cool. They're on sale already. So they are. So let's talk about this year's theme. What can right. we all expect? It's a salute to veterans and their families is what we uh, went with this year. It's an opportunity not just to focus on a particular group or a particular uh, time frame in our history, but to look at all of our veterans and then the support that their families have given them through the years. And uh, you'll see different themes throughout the uh, the air show itself focused on different groups. So it's, it's uh, it'll be fun to work with and a lot of opportunity there. What does the air show mean for all the people at Miramar? You know, the purpose of the air show really is to, is to open the gates of Miramar and let San Diego onto the base and get them a chance to understand uh, what their Marine Corps is doing. And I use the words their Marine Corps on purpose because it is their Marine Corps. And, uh, and it's right here in San Diego. The 3rd Marine Aircraft Wing is here and uh, everything that they, they bring and have to offer, along with the Marine Air Ground Task Force that we bring down, people can really see who we are, how we operate, and what we're all about. Okay. Hey, and I know one of the big questions, the Blue Angels, are they coming back? <laughs> so that's a great and the answer is absolutely the Blue Angels right. are going to be here. Uh, along with the Patriots jet team who we've had in the past, and this year for the first time on their U.S. tour is the Breitling jet team coming in from Europe. So three big jet teams is going to be outstanding. Tell us a little bit more about them because it's going to be their first time, right? Their first time on a U.S. tour. Wow. It is. They fly L-39, so similar airplane, the same airplane really as the uh, Patriots jet team, but they have their own spin to it, and uh, they fly a very dynamic show. It'll be fun to watch. And uh, just like, you know, typically in the past we have two good jet teams. Here we have three now, along with the F-35 coming back and uh, the MB-22 Osprey, the Harrier, all the crowd favorites. How do you decide who gets in the air show? I know there are a lot of returning acts, there so are, to speak. Yeah. But there must be those that submit and say, hey, this would be a good addition to the air show. And what do you, how do you go about saying whether or not that can happen? Absolutely. So, uh, like I said, 14-month process. There's only so many hours in the day. The show is three days long. And a lot of people want to come to Miramar because San Diego shows up out there. So there are some that are crowd favorites we know are going to come back. And we really try to keep with the cutting edge and the newest airplanes that are out there, things that we can see, and then bring back some of those um, uh, older uh, aircraft and just to reminisce, you know, and see the difference in time. There's a hundred years of aviation that'll be flying or on display out there. Wow. And uh, we just try to keep that variety so it's something fresh and new for everybody. Do they get to come try out for you? You get to see and pick who you like? You know, there's a, <laughs> it's interesting. They try out every air show uh, across the nation and everybody knows what their acts are all about and who they are. And uh, boy, they're on all the time. So that's it. It's and a big the, deal. And the technology, of course, we do this. What was it? The F-35, I think, is the yes. one of the latest jets coming down. It is down. the newest airplane. That's right. And are we going to see the F-35 there as well? It is. It'll be coming over from Yuma, where we have a squadron of them. They'll do an, a demonstration, and there'll be one on the ground. Uh, we were able to do that last year as well. And that airplane, I, I can't describe it. It's fantastic. Something to see. Well, I was going to, you know, I know you can't describe it, yeah. but in terms of the difference, because when I look at these high-tech aircraft, you look at the F-18, which has been right. around now for 30-some-odd years. A fantastic airplane. Ex right. Exactly. And, and as a well, wow, really fast, really powerful. What's the F-35 doing that the others can't? Yeah, it's interesting. The F-18 has evolved over time for sure with the avionics that that airplane has. The F-35 is just this quantum leap forward in understanding information and uh, being able to understand the uh, space below you. It's just a, uh, a flying information node, and it feeds it to the pilot in a way where they're just capable of things out of that airframe that we just can't do now. Ah. It's, it's astonishing. Any drone technology going to be there? Uh, we're working hard to get some uh, unmanned aircraft associated. They'll be on the ground for sure. We're working hard to get them into the air so they can see that. So they'll be on display. You can see them sure. in a booth or something yep, like that. Absolutely. All right. And let's talk dates. and. Uh... So it's uh, October 2nd okay. through the 4th, uh, www.miramarairshow.com has all the details. It's free to everyone, uh, but there are better seats. If you want to uh, purchase uh, better seats in the bleachers or in the, the chalets, those are available as well, and you can all find all that on that website. There are lots of air shows, yes. you know, but this is quintessential San Diego. It's just it something about it. Yeah. It reflects San Diego because San Diego shows up for the air show. It's the largest military air show in the nation. It's 500,000 people plus every year. Amazing. And uh, if there's something to be seen in an air show, it will happen at Miramar, I promise. Colonel Farnham, we'll see you there. Yeah, thanks a lot. Right. Appreciate Thank the opportunity. Appreciate Thank you. And straight ahead, uh, Senator's getting free rides.